All right, Spartan fans, we're here post game with Ray Corbo, the hero, and I am standing in the exact spot where Ray Corbo hit the game winning three pointer. All net at the buzzer, getting a win over University of Maryland Eastern Shore, 61 to 58. And Ray, what, what were your thoughts as that ball released from your hands? I was just hoping that it would go in so we wouldn't have to play overtime. So that was all I was hoping for, that it was going to go in. And a lot of accolades from the Spartan fans here. Um, Ray, also, you, you were also able to hit a lot of points in that second half as well. Um, scoring 10 of your 16 in the second half. So going to the second half, what was your mindset given that you guys were, were a bit of an offensive funk? Um, I just wanted to, you know, keep playing good defense. <laughs> you know, they if we weren't scoring, I didn't want them to score. So that's what I was thinking about. And, um, you know, just getting rebounds, keep pushing the ball. And eventually we would start scoring points. So that was my mindset. And now you're coming off a big win against George Mason University. And then you get a win like this. You get a shot at the buzzer. And then you have Howard coming in here Monday night. So what does this do for your team's confidence and your confidence as well? Um, this is definitely a confidence booster for the team. Um, I know Howard's going to come in. They're definitely going to try, you know, roll over us like they did last year. But, you know, it's a new team. It's a new year. So we definitely, we definitely have a lot of confidence coming into this one. And, you know, we're definitely going to be tougher. So I think it's going to be a good one on Monday. And lastly, I got to ask you, who's your favorite basketball player? Kevin Durant. Wasn't that very Kevin Durant like? Kevin Durant's name to Whitney right before Ty inbounded the ball, but I don't think she understood what I was saying. I, I was like Kevin Durant, <laughs> and I, yeah. <laughs> but she didn't understand what you were saying. Like as long as you hit the shot, I don't care who, whose name you say. But nonetheless, the Spartans get the victory, sixty-one fifty-eight, thanks to the hero on the evening, Ray Corbo. Good job tonight. Thank you. Rachel Gordon here, you had eight big rebounds for the Spartans tonight. Um, but that was a great ending, just so dramatic. I mean, when you saw that ball go up in the air, did you think it was good? I was hoping it was good, but I was ready to tip it in. But me and Ray, we just shoot shots like that all the time. So I was glad it went in. Oh, so that's, that's just practice, huh? So uh, as you look forward to this game, of course, you know, when you look at your numbers, of course, I know you're not pleased, eight rebounds, just two points, but enable the, the ability for your team to rally and get the win, given that you know everyone didn't play their best game. How does, how does that make you feel as you guys move forward and host Howard Monday night? Well, I know that if we can play like this and we won, then if we play our, if everybody plays their game, gets the points and rebounds, then I know we can do major damage in the MEAC. Speak about your other post teammate, about Tavia Owens, another big game. She was playing with four fouls, and then you also good on, on, on the rebounding. How big will your post play be against Howard this come Monday night? Um, it'll be really big because um, Sadia Doyle, she's really good, and then I heard they got two new good post players in there, and we're going to be needed to do our job, make points, and get rebounds and everything. Nonetheless, Ray, Ray just told me that um, she said Kevin Durant to Whitney Long before the inbounds play. That was very Kevin Durant-like, wasn't it? Yeah, she loves Kevin Durant. <laughs> Definitely playing like him. But nonetheless, the Spartans get the win tonight, 61-58. Good job tonight by Rachel Gordon. <laughs>